Hey there everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Code Vein. So the YouTube protest is finally over. I don't know how successful it was. It was actually surprisingly difficult to not be on YouTube 24-7. But I'm back now, so let's go ahead and do that. I am still looking for a YouTube alternative because I... Where? Oh, there they are. I do not agree with the stuff that they were basically doing with the whole Copa mess. While I do feel Copa is required, not the way that they're doing it. The way that they're doing it is a hot mess. And that is the part I do not agree with. I don't think there's a way over there, is there? That just looks like a dead end. We'll assume that's a dead end. So this is the way I need to go. Now the issue is where do I go afterwards? Now, I did do some more research. The successor needs the Skathoth, or however you pronounce it, those parts, needs all five of them. Those we have, parts A through E. So I'll go ahead and restore those once we get to the successor's crypt, which is apparently not that far either. Oh, great. One of these guys again. Come on. Run at me, buddy. Nope. You're dead. I really do hate the fact that there's nothing I can do to prevent this fire damage on me. I've already looked into it. The fire tonic doesn't do anything to it. Neither does just any particular outfit. Alright, so there's a chest over here on that side. We have to go around this way. Dodged you. How did I miss this last time? Skatash Chrome. Oh, it's one of these guys. Alright, these guys actually do take a bit of a walloping. Okay, that actually kind of terrified me. Okay, that's one fight down. Oh, got something we can use. That was a bit more than I was expecting back here. This treasure chest better be something good. Sheesh. This place is crazy. White vestment. I don't know what that is. Hello. Goodbye. I'll let you stay down there. Are you? No, you're not. A stuffed toy? Okay. I'll just say I'll let you stay down there. All right, there we go. That takes care of him. I don't think I was actually supposed to come down this way. Dang it, I really wasn't. Oh my God. Oh, great. Now I gotta walk all through that fire again. Now, I don't think I'll make this one a Mega Mix episode today, only unless the boss just takes that many attempts. Um, the only reason I say that is because of the fact that I know the boss fight is coming up. Like, it's literally around the corner. In fact, I literally think it's around the corner. We're not far. Hang in there. Yeah, I was about to say, pretty sure the crypt is right. Yep, it's right there. That's the crypt. So I can heal here, get all my stuff back can level up if I can level 91 I'll take it all right here you are just hold on Emily I've been waiting Thebe hi Thebe please spin a thread of memory for me so the Skatash Skathosh. Skathosh. Skathosh Vestige. I don't know how to pronounce that one. Alright, so let's see what's em Emily's memories. Reinforcements! Two o'clock! Damn it, they just keep coming. Mikkel, Mikkel Emily, Emily, we're falling, we're falling back. back. I can't. I can't, I can't walk, walk anymore. anymore. 
Come on, fight. It's just a bit farther. We're all going back home alive. back to the front after we eat, right? I want to make sure I go out there with a full tank. Are you hanging in there, Emily? I'm just fine. Your own Erie really did the trick, Yakimo. The fighting's been hot for a while. Take it easy and watch yourself. Okay, am I supposed to... Oh. What are you doing here? Need to get some rest, or else you're gonna be all groggy tomorrow. Never I think we'll have to listen to Nido forever. It makes it hard for me to fall asleep. Don't worry. I don't intend to let that happen. I promise. One of these days, we're going to take our freedom back, and I mean all of us, together. Yeah, I like the sound of that. I have no idea what I'd do without you guys. Well, that's one memory down. What the hell is this thing? Nothing we do even phases it. It looks, it looks like they've, like got, they've us got us surrounded. surrounded. We need we to need open to an exit. exit. I'll create a distraction. We want both of you to use it to escape. Destroying, Destroying their footing their should, should slow them slow down. down. Can you do that, Emily? Emily. You, bet. you bet. Just say when. We saved our hides this time, didn't we? Oh, some sharp thinking. It's because I'm always watching you, Yakimo. My body just responded on its own. You're watching me? Oh, um, you know, as an example of what to do. <laughs> I need to learn how to pull my own weight, right? <laughs> I like your attitude. Yakumo, my guy. Looks like we don't have time to sit around and chat. Do you not realize that Emily's into you, my guy? I wonder what they were fighting. Maybe a successor? Run, damn it. Keep your eyes forward and move. I kind of want to turn. Wow. Oh, good. You're finally awake, Emily. What happened? We were surrounded by those monsters, and then... That bastard Nito told me when I woke up. Apparently, he brought us back to life as revenants. And we aren't the only ones. He's done the same thing to Yakima and the others, too. I was waiting for everyone to wake up. I don't know much else, though. So I'm guessing they died fighting the Lost? I don't know what kind of Lost sounds like that. That was... Pretty big. That was like a Godzilla kind of size. Well, I guess it will have to do. It's time to put you to work. Are you kidding me? Why would we ever listen to you again? Because obedience is your only option. Unless you want me to dispose of your sleeping friends, that is. You son of a... Your task is simple. Defend me from the frenzied queen. Laying down your very life should it prove necessary. I expect you to serve me diligently in this purpose. So as far as I know, Miguel became the Gilded Hunter. And Emily's the successor? And each time, I felt so 
something important slip away. The only thing I had to look forward to was the day when Yakna would finally wake up. Not gonna lie, it does change the perspective of the game when. Excellent. Your efforts have provided me with a fine sample. The queen will fall, and humanity's next evolution will blossom. I expect nothing but continued success from you. It does change the story perspective a bit when you realize that every death that your character faces makes them forget a little bit more about themselves. Granted, my character has amnesia, so less of a factor. But it's different when it's like, okay, Yakumo has, you know, gone and died. And then you're forgetting random bits of your human life from that. And now that, you know, this is Yakumo coming full circle. He's basically freed one of his friends from the pains of the past, which was Miguel, who got trapped where uh, Mito had him, and he was just there forever. Now I have to go through Emily and, you know, save everything about that. This is This is going to be a really emotional thing for Yakumo. So I think it's appropriate that I have him in the battle. All right, and then I'll use the cartridges once I'm in here. Oh, what? Ooh. A Hellcat. It's just like what happened with Nicola. Emily. Don't be reckless. We have to. <laughs> You're kidding, right? You were all alone, Emily. It must have been so hard. But not anymore. I'll bring your suffering to an end. Just hold on. A little while longer. Lots of cat-like moves. Note to self. Uh-uh. Backstep. Backstep. Freezing cartridge. Venom cartridge. I don't know if they stack like that, but they do. Uh-uh. Take some of this. Take this. Take this. Why do you have a sword on your back? That looks so cool. There you go. There you go. There you go. Catch these hands. Catch these hands. Catch these hands. Caught some damage. Oh, whoa! Oh, she she does use a sword. Ow! Oh god, she's a whole ninja. She could throw knives and everything. Holy Jesus! Oh god! Stop! Stop! You're a little too fast for me. You got the Yakumo for a minute. So she teleports and then dashes around. Ow, Jesus. I would have no problem with this. Wow, that is, that is an anime shot if I've ever seen one. Whatever, she's about to die. There we go. She's down. We win. I'm so sorry, Emily. Oh, I'm supposed to fall down here. Those pitiful creatures have fallen in their attempts to climb. 
No, they're still asleep. That's all. They'll wake up before long. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury to coddle late bloomers. However, their failure will fuel your success, for they will serve as offerings to your ascension. Wait. Whatever you want to do, just do it to me. Oh, an intriguing offer. Keep your grubby fingers off them. So he legit just threw revenants into the trash heap if they didn't meet his standards, I guess. Sending all, and eventually, consuming all. Just you wait, Gregorio. Who, who's Gregorio? I will come for you. And how did Mito die? Did Emily kill him? Emily, I know that's you. Come here. I'm coming to restore you. Sorry it took me so long to get here, but, well. Don't worry. It was my decision, after all. I... I was supposed to keep you all safe. I'm sorry, Emily. Come on, Yakumo. We like you because you're always pushing forward and not dwelling on the past. Up to you growing up, so pull yourself together already. Sorry, what did I just say? <laughs> uh, you're still as fierce as ever, aren't you? <laughs> I really am glad, though. I didn't think I would ever see you again. Thank you, Yakumo. Tell her you love her, Yakumo. Do it, my guy. Give her a smooch. <laughs> I guess stomachs don't know any better. Sheesh. <laughs> Here, take this. You're Onigiri. I've been waiting for this. Eat it before you turn to stone. Thank you. I ship this. Ah, that was wonderful. 
Are you sure you don't want more? You always wanted more. I'm satisfied. Because, you know... Hey, wait. So, Yakumo... There's something I'd like you to do for me. Yes, sir! Do you remember how you used to hold me when I was little? Could you... This is also acceptable. Is this all right? Perfect. Thank you. Yakumo, you... No, 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 no. That's more frustrating than the last one. Restore. You come back. You're not allowed to die. You gotta confess to the boy! together again. That's all that matters to me. What were you going to say earlier? Hmm? You know, you were saying something. Oh, uh, well... You won't laugh? <laughs> Why would I? I've always loved... Hirotagiri! I can't get enough! That's all. <laughs> what was that it? Well, you're in luck. Because for you, I'm happy to make as many as you like, as often as you want. Good. I'll be waiting. Close enough, I guess. Thank you, Emily. Well, you got me in your pocket now. You're already carrying a lot on your shoulders. Let's carry it together, okay? Well, time to move. Come on. Let's get going. Just you wait. I swear, I'll make that bastard pay for what he's done. Wait, is he alive or not? Because he had a whole vestige.
As far as I know, anyone that leaves a vestige has been dead so far, with the exception of... Oh, never mind. He's, he's there. He's alive and well. That was such a moving scene. In fact, I almost found myself laughing. You, Mito. Hmm, interesting. I don't see little Jack anywhere. Dealing with the successors was supposed to be his job. Saves us a search anyway. Your ass, pal! Jack, my boy, you're late. How can you be slacking off when you've got such an important job? I'm here to take back all of the relics you stole. Oh, and do what with them exactly? After all, your vessel is broken. What are you talking about? Oh, my. You didn't notice? I gave your precious Eva a little present. You're under the impression that you allowed her to escape. That is incorrect. I allowed her to escape. That's... I installed a prototype in that lovely throat of hers. But then, that means she was already... Damn you! I imagine that she'll frenzy before long, and a frenzied relic will be compelled to seek Gregorio. Do you suppose she's already wandering the snow-capped mountains? <laughs> Successors, won't you? As for me, I must say farewell to a certain dotard. Get back here, you coward! It can't be, Eva. I have to go find her. All right. Skathash. Skah. Well balanced for both gifts and physical attack specialized in fire based gifts. Nice. All right. But that takes care of this boss. Hi there, Emily. Yakumo, you came to visit. Oh. Leaving already? Yakumo. Hey, Yakumo, did you make me some omigiri? Yeah, not as many as you'd like, though. The things you have to do to get rice these days. Hooray! I can put up with anything as long as I have these. Thanks for going out of your way for me. Take good care of yourselves, you guys. Wait, so you can have cute little cutscenes depending on who your partner is? Wait a minute. As always, we gotta go back here. Pick up that other vestige. Now, though, what I wanna do is, real quick, return to the other crypts. 
So, did you forget something? Yes, I can talk to you. Okay, cool. I hope there's something I can do to help everyone. That's it. I can train again just like I used to. With this form, I'll be even stronger than you, Mia. Don't be silly. What if something happens to you? Leave everything to us, Nicola. Aww. Well, I guess I'll have to train on my own then. Just in case. Aww, Nicola wants to help. Let the boy help, man. Big rocket boy man with horns. Alright, so then one more. Yes. Karen sleeping peacefully in the heart room. You should look in on her if you have the time. I'm sure she would appreciate it. That's it. That's all you gotta say? Okay. A pure blood. Nothing? Okay. Alright, well, that takes care of everything that I want to see, at least extra cutscene wise. And we actually finished off the City of uh, Falling Flames. So I think that is enough for this episode, guys. We did do the boss fight, we got some extra cutscenes, we got the backstory of, you know, what was going on there. So I will go ahead and leave this episode off here, guys. We will pick up on the next episode. It will be the next Mega Mix episode of Let's Play Code Vein. If you liked today's episode, go to give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Hit that subscribe button. If you aren't already subscribed, join the Curly Crew. And I will catch you all here next time. I hope you all have a great and wonderful day.